Oh, it was not very nice. It was not very nice. At a certain point, when it was the, the monkey, we said, we don't shoot anymore if you kill this monkey. And, say, and so I say, everybody decided to don't shoot anymore. And then what's happened with the monkey? You killed the monkey in any case, did you? It was horrible. And then after that, after that, he promised to use only the, the butcher um, animals. Yeah, the animals that in any case the butcher would would, uh, would, yeah, would kill use, in any yes. case. But I don't know that after the monkey there were a lot of animals, no more, no. There was the pig after the monkey. Yeah, but that yeah, was a pig, butcher animal. animal. Yeah, that was that yeah. was an animal everyone. Yeah, you could didn't. Eat. They didn't ask you to shoot it. Well, <laughs> I'm not, yeah, 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 but that was the butcher. Yeah, no, I rode in the in the boat with that pig. He was yeah. my friend. I don't like deer, but I'll kill a pig. I I eat those. So, uh, are you a vegetarian? Uh, no. So okay, let's 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 forgive the the, the pig for. One. No, let's not forget the pig. <laughs> the, the rest is unforgivable. Because the pig was a pig, the pig happened. You know, I, I wasn't there for the turtle, um, but I just I just want to add to what Francesca no, said no, about the monkey. No, no, the turtles was horrible. The, the worst experience of my life. The monkey it was really disgusting, you know, and in. But the guy who killed the monkey was really excited. But you know, you, you have people Which that kill other people. You know, you know that there are people that they kill other people that are very excited. To no, 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 no. Because so the, the monkey brains, the, the monkey so brains are a delicacy. Other people, if you're not excited to do it, isn't it? Do you remember this, uh, Ruggiero? That the the guy who did, killed the monkey, he was he. I don't know if you remember or not, but no, no, no. The the, the monkey killed only one monkey. Yeah, yeah, yeah right. The, the Indians. So sweet little monkey. The Indians, because they the eat, most sweet monkey eat the alive. monkey. <laughs> but the monkey brains are, are a delicacy, and that's why he was so excited. Not to me, but to the guy who did it. In Japan, too? Of course. <laughs> the brains of a tea bagger. Oh, thank you. Exactly. You ever seen a monkey's head stuck in the middle of a tea? The story of the monkey, the story of the animals, is a very. False, because a lot. False. I, I, I should in that one movie, the last cannibal world, have the, some uh, animal kill him, but it's not me. The <coughs> producer, after finishing the film, movie, filmed this. <coughs> filmed this because in Orient, Orient, the country, the Oriental, want the animal dead. Uh, when I shoot it, cannibal cows, uh, all uh, oriented country want something animals. And I, uh, me, no, 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 no. After I say, okay, I arrange it with this. One mouse, little mouse. You disturb one mouse? No, for me, no, 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 no. Okay, we kill one mouse. What happened with the mouse? The, the Indians uh, eat the, the mouse, yes. Burn the jungle for, 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 for culture, that. Uh, it's normal, okay, my bad. After the little pig, little pig, you eat uh, prosciutto, salmon, salame. Okay, but it's not this, the, the importance. She, in all, eating every day fish for Rio delle Amazzoni. All people vomitation, ah, every day uh, fish from, uh, from uh, Amazonia is terrible. The, the wardrobe uh, Roman, typical Roman woman, he said, Ruggero, please kill the little pork because tonight I prepare for you <laughs> like a porchetta, <laughs> like a porchetta, because uh, every day the, 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 the fish, the fish. Okay, why not? I call uh, Luca Barbareschi, another actor, say, tomorrow you Look kill the, okay. La, how? You, just, you, you shoot, it's normal. All uh, pig shoot like that, uh, died like that. Okay, and this is the second. Tortu, no, we have uh, the Guida, Guida, what's it? The guide. The guide, really guide for the forest. For the Amazon. For the Amazon. He said, uh, I, I said, I talk with him, please uh, let me know when uh, 
we have uh, some animal who uh, need uh, the Indians need. Uh, he, go, he called me one day. He said, "Yes, uh, one um, the uh, Tunche. Tunche is uh, the boss, uh, the chief of the Indians. Said uh, want uh, he want uh, he uh, uh, buy a uh, capture one tortug. Uh, he want uh, eat with the whole uh, tribe. Okay." Uh, but it's possible I cut, I, I kill me, yes, with the guide. I, 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 I kill the guide, Gui guide. And this is uh, three. The monkey is different because the monkey every day is uh, like a pasta shooter for the Indians. The little monkey eat every day. Hey, one day I film it is. But uh, it's a strange because uh, the Indians capture three monkey for, for the lunch for, for the tribu and kill only one because contemporaneously in the same time in the same time died for heart attack the other two. This is the story, the real story. Basically, you're saying you ate the animals, you know, other than the monkey. And, but and I, uh, I am a friend I, I, of. Uh, David knows when I shoot in the, uh, the, the angel, angel the, I said all day with the one monkey. Yeah. Because the monkey, I, I have all movie I have one monkey with me. Because the monkey is strange. Love the chief. Because who scream more, this is the friend. He, sh he bite all people, but not me. He didn't, he he didn't bite me. He, he bite you. No, he didn't bite me. Oh, well, you bite. No, but uh, me is a, a when I should uh, finish the movie, a, I must to leave uh, uh, the day after. The monk has said with me, is one still come from uh, the highs. Uh. And look at me. I he knows I I I live. Uh, when I, I leave, I leave to to Pacific for 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 see um, another uh, location for another movie. Uh, uh, before I, I must to take the plane for Italy. I go to jungle for, with the honor of the monkey for visit. He said, "He's going. He's going after you." Leave is going from the forest. Imagine. I let the monkey go. I love the monkey. All movies is with, with me. What? I have uh, one more my See, monkey. I, I've always been confused because I always thought I was a member of PETA until I realized it didn't mean people eating tasty animals. I, can uh, um, I don't want to walk serious here, but just for a little bit, you know, I, I, you fuck with my environment, I'm going to fuck with you. Don't fuck with the animals, don't fuck with me, don't fuck with anybody because, you know, we all have a right to live, you know, uh, um, uh, compa in, in, in a compatible situation. If you're going into a, to a country, into the Amazon, um, and I've been there, I haven't done a film there, but I've been there, that's a whole different ecology, it, it's a whole different consciousness. You have to wonder what, what those Indians do when they're not making a film, how much they get paid. Maybe they made some money on this film that they would have never made in their lives before. Maybe, you know, maybe it helped out their ecology. And I think Ruggiero has a really bad rap in the sense that there's this rumor going around that he kills animals. I agree. Too. That's fucking bullshit, I man. Agree and too, I'm, I want it to stop right now. I agree also. <laughs> bad jokes aside, I agree with you. That he, he doesn't mutilate animals for no reason. Yes, exactly. Uh, uh, let's, let's change no, the subject here. Or, after another I really say something. Really thing. Oh, I agree with you. 30 years ago, it's a change. It's, it's another moment. Another moment because uh, after the war, the, the people is the, it was different from now. Now, one young man go look uh, in the television, cut the Iraq or American uh, head. It don't do nothing. L go uh, look at uh, one little cat with uh, the leg. Ah, oh, poor. 
it's different now. Yeah. Before, is it is normal? I go to the country. The the, the 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 country people said today we kill the pork. All people in the holiday. Right. Yeah, everybody eats a little the, pig. Yeah. We, we, the people live, uh, stay with the with the country. Look at the the die. Now the grandfather died. No, before the grandfather or oh, one father died, the mother or the, the grandmother said, "Go to visit the the, the body of the your grandfather." Now. <gasps> You must to remember when he's alive. I don't, I did, 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 the grandfather go alone in the cemetery. It's, it's changed, all the change. Before, the died is a, is a lie, is a life. The died and the life is the same thing. Now it's changed. I don't know, in television now you, you see everything. Body is cut, cut that. Before, no, no in television. But in reality, maybe you, do you see something? But for that, I think, is different. 31 years ago was all different. Completely now, different. Completely I, different. I agree with you. David agrees with you. Exactly. You guys, um, you want to look at a Rossellini film sometime, so you get so you get a sense of where Ruggiero started. Another great film to look. Go look at Bicycle Thief. Have any has anybody in here seen Bicycle Thief? Okay. Oh look. You want to see Bicycle Thief? You want to see some violence because of starvation? Look at Bicycle Thief. Exactly. Yeah. It exists. Yeah. Okay. Not only does it exist on film, but it exists in reality. And we as filmmakers have have the duty. We absolutely have the duty to express that. We don't have the right to kill indiscriminately, but we need to express it. Switching, switching gears to the romantic comedy classic House on the Edge of the Park. <laughs> um, yeah, we wanted to go. We want. We, we need to. to fun we're, uh, it's going to be screened weekend. momentarily here. And um, of all the romantic comedies made in the '70s and '80s, this is my personal favorite. And I have. Um, I'm wondering what background you, in your own head, and or formally gave your character. There's a few obvious facts about your character. He wears a dog tag, so we can assume possibly that he's a vet. He has a close bond with his friend, played by Giovanni Lombardo Radice. But I'm wondering, David, what backstory you gave your character and how you approached that character? Well, I had, um, I, you know, I had the experience of doing two other films. I did Hitchhike and I did uh, Last House, uh, you know, earlier. Um, uh, for me, they were um, they were all studies in psychosis, and I'm one bad psychotic, so I had no problem. The backstory was there to begin with. Uh, no, seriously, it. Ah, uh, oh, if you don't believe him, ask my wife. Um, I, I dumbed him down a little bit because he was dumb. Because he was, you know, he thought he was in control, and then there was never any control with him. It was always, it was always being set up. But uh, the, I, for me. Most films have have a touch of, uh, um, especially horror films. I've always felt this, have a touch of uh, um, of film noir. You know, you don't see it as a film noir, but there's always that 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 concept of heart of darkness, where you're led and led and led and led until you can't go any further, and then you know, then you expire. So uh, I, I really use that as a metaphor more than anything else. You know, did to, you find any inspiration create... in another character, or did you just find it within and say, "Damn it, I'm going to go for it"? Me. Um, well, a lot of it had to do with just Ruggiero and I on the set. You know, because there was a uh, the uh, the dialogue. You know, a lot of times we just made up the dialogue. You know, because there were there were a lot of different languages that were being spoken, and and. And contrary to what people think, Ruggiero does understand English real well. He fakes it, though. <laughs> yeah, but but, but uh, well, when, I, when, you hear, when it comes to House by the Edge of the Park, people have told me, "Gee, it starts out dull." I'm like, "It starts out with a rape and a murder." 
right. it doesn't get any non fucking duller than that. No, no. It starts out with the setup, is what it does. Exactly. But you when know, you have a rape scene before the opening credits, you know you're in for a wild ride. That's what we call a wasteland movie, you know. So, but then then there's the credits, and there's only 20 minutes with a build up, and blammo, we're off again. I think it's a great movie. If you've never seen it, it, it is playing after one of the, the greatest pound. movies ever made. Um, as a side note, before I ask Ruggiero to describe the real life story that he based it on or got the idea from, um, I would just like to say that I highly recommend watching versions of House on the Edge of the Park in other languages. Watch it dubbed. Particularly, you need to watch the French version because when David has his character get shot in the crotch at the end of that movie, the French dubbing is absolutely hilarious. It's it's a must. <laughs> Something like that. It yes. is like that. It is like. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus, it's, my balls just got shot up. <laughs> it's a, it's a it, must. It, 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 it's like Dave's going, God, I'm glad I'm not French. But um, I, I personally did not know until a few years ago when I first spoke with Ruggiero, um, what real life event was the story that inspired you to do House on the Edge of the Park? Can I just interject something before he starts? Sure. I, I got I to gotta tell you guys about Italian cinema very, very quickly. They hire you, you get paid, and they always keep 20% so you can do the next film. <laughs> <laughs> but you're doing the next film, so they always add the 20% to the next film. You keep going that way, and eventually you figure that out. It's a real... Um, it, it, the whole of the European film industry, especially the Italians, don't... don't first off, they don't take themselves as seriously as we do, which I think is a, is, is a, is a bonus. And secondly, they're not about the money. They're, they're really about, about the family and about making a film, which, uh, which I am too. No, the, the real story is uh, one really story happened in, uh, in Italy. The younger boys, the Quartieri Alti, the young boys of uh, high society. High society. Hanno preso, hanno violentato. Okay, tu parli, io, io traduco. Okay, the big boys from uh, high society in Italy, they, ah. they kidnap. Hanno violentato, and, uh, hanno preso due ragazze, le hanno abused, portate in una villa. Took it in a, in, a, in a place like a villa, like a house with gardens. Le hanno violentate. They take advantage of the girls. Poi eh, le hanno messe, le hanno ammazzate and then they kill them. e le hanno messe dentro il, nel bagagliaio della macchina poi sono andati been, tranquillamente sono tornati a Roma da questo they, piccolo they've been back to Rome to continue. Eh, e sono andati a un pub and si they, sono they ubriacati drunk. e però nel momento dal bagagliaio una delle due non era morta. E come... in fact in the boots one of the two girls was not really died. It was not dead. E ha cominciato a battere sul And so it start to knock knock. E, e quindi sono arrivata gente, la notte fuori. Some people they arrive and they open the boots and they found that there was one girl died and another one almost died. Ah, e la storia però finale che si, si avvicina un po' alla nostra storia è che i tre ragazzi di buona famiglia the three boys of the, the high avendo dei soldi a disposizione avendo money, molti soldi a disposizione money, sono stati money. coperti dai genitori uno è partito they have been, they have been, uh, uno è, part by the parents. One is left, uno è partito per l'Africa uh, e, e non si sapeva dove stava. And un altro è andato in Argentina, in Argentina e un altro, come al solito, ha avuto la, and, and, and è stato one, preso dal, cioè è, stato, è andato in Francia, dove è, avuto, France, dove è stato protetto dalle autorità francesi perché loro, qualsiasi persona, been, you know, ammazza been, qualcuno per un fatto politico. Lo, ha, lo mettono in Francia perché loro erano difensori sempre. Ok, in France, in France has been protected, so eh. possibly he didn't have any extradition at the time, so eh. because the, usually the French people, the say, Ruggero say, they, they was used to, to defend and protect the, the, the killer. Questa storia, so siccome, this story, io, siccome io appartengo come nascita me, Ruggero, I belong, ai figli de, dell'alta società, this, this, uh, society, 
e volevo andare proprio contro questi invece di ragazzi delle borgate disperati e di quanto tu be critico tu cosa volevi fare? Volevo andare contro questi ragazzi delle borgate delle dis... borgate di buona famiglia no, i ragazzi di buona famiglia io, io essendo stato figlio di una buona famiglia mi sono messo a, a proteggere invece i ragazzi che vengono okay. dalle borgate. And he that he was born in this uh, in this uh, I would say ambience, you know, people that they, they are uh, high society, uh, wealthy, whatever. He wanted to protect and defend the, the other guys, the guys that they come from a much simple background. Perché un conto i ragazzi di buona famiglia sono dei delinquenti e possono Because at the time, and we see, we see, we see at, at the time, the, 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 the guy of a certain society in Italy, that they think that everything is allowed to them. Non hanno nessuna and ragione di essere right. cattivi perché sono nati bene tutto quanto. Gli altri invece se sono dei delinquenti è perché invece la vita per loro è molto triste. E so, in fact, they, they don't have any right, the, the, the guys that are born well. To allora io ho scelto... Okay. Il disperato. So he decided to choose uh, some, someone S, so desperate, un disperato, like a desperate guy un, like David S. Che nella vita sua è proprio un cattivo, that un, life, un violentatore, life, però, really nasty guy, really a violent person, però non but, puoi andare contro di lui perché è nato male, poverino. But you cannot go ma lui sia David so S che il personaggio. È so badly born either David S than the character of the movie. E quindi chi muore poverino who con died? tutte le sue violenze che ha fatto nel film però chi va a finire died? morto è povero David S who die is the poor quindi David io S. sono stato mi sono messo come nei cannibal holocaust con, a favore degli indios so, like in questo Canada, film mi sono messo Holocaust, a favore wanted, del povero David S to, to, che non ha nessuna colpa della sua cattiveria io said to show how good they are or, or I said I wanted to protect the indios and say look I'm in favor of the indios and, but in this time who I want to non ho capito quello di David S. Ho protetto David S. che poi non ah, ha nessuna it, colpa it, it di want, essere così it, cattivo, okay, violentatore, mascalzone. In a um, in a moment, we're going to open this up Donahue style with the wireless microphone. But uh, another question for David S. How did your old Cindy O Cindy song from your record end up being the song sung as you're mutilating the character Cindy in House on the Edge of the Fork? Uh, Ruggiero liked the song, plain and simple. Cindy O Cindy, da 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 da. But the thing is, it, the da, thing is it, da, da, yeah, it was rewritten because Italians always rewrite and then steal the song. No, this. <laughs> this All right, we're, we are vastly, we, we're, we, we're we have pushing gone about an hour, so. We, we would like to open it up. We, as you, everybody who's been here knows, we do like to uh, let fans ask a few questions. Um, I will do this Donahue style with a cordless. Does anybody in the first row have a good question for anyone on our panel tonight? Anybody. Damn you bastards make me walk and pass those. Has anybody in the back row got anything? Like, me and Art can just sit here and talk for another 10 minutes and call it a day, but does anybody have a nice question for We have Tom over here. Here you go, Tom. Come on up and ask uh, your question on the... Are you uh, planning on a sequel to Cannibal Holocaust? There's been rumors. Many rumors over many years. Uh, allora, sì. Mi hanno chiesto molte volte tu e te Okay, sorry. Yeah, <laughs> they, they asked me so many times. Di girare un cannibal numero due. To, to make a, a cannibal number two. E ho cercato in tutti i modi di, di pensare And di farne uno. Anyway, how to do one. Ma poi ragionandoci ho detto ma end, se io ho, ho fatto un film che doveva essere passato per verità e dopo che è uscito il film che è passato all'inizio sulla verità and the, the movie has done all it is so practically it became famous because it, everybody was thinking it was a real movie ma dopo un po' si è capita la mistificazione and del, after del... You, you even uh, understand that it was a mystification of the reality allora mi sono detto ma che vado a fare un film 
Why should che I? Non ha senso, non make ha senso. Make another one, which is the, the meaning of the sense. Eh, lasciamo agli altri fare Let's i to someone else do, 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 do follow. Eh, per me era finito lì. Perché for, for Rogers finished where he was. È come, cioè, avevo fatto scoppiare una bomba. È un film per la prima volta, come è stato il fatto di Orson Welles quando ha, ha dichiarato che... Eh, alla he, radio. He, make, he make a explosive bomb, so eh, something sì. like, a, like a, the, sì, the, the, the fight of uh, Orson Welles. No? Cioè, he declared at, at the radio that he, uh, people from planet Mars, Mars planets, they're coming. Poi quando si scopre che invece non è vero And questo, then in the end of the day when you discover that this is not true, inventare una cosa che poi is non, useless to invent another something non ha più quella novità. That it allora, doesn't have any new with you anymore. Di, di girare intorno a questo ho cercato And so we try to turn around at this point ho cambiato che ne so cut and run voleva essere una cosa del genere ma non, non era possibile but at the end of the day it doesn't find any, any, any opportunity or possibility to, to make another e poi invece ultimamente ho avuto cioè ho avuto dei produttori che mi hanno chiesto di, di fare un cannibal eh, sì, basta così, eh? and in the end at the end now they ha, eh. he had some producer that they asked him to, to make a, a new cannibal eh, ma poi dopo un po' ci ho rinunciato but at the end of the day he uh, say no forget thank you but you are planning on a house on the edge of the park too we recently heard discussion of this this is a different thing because it's going to be a musical right because because <laughs> no <laughs> io ho detto prima che sono un masochista okay, allora, I'm, dove... a, I'm a masochista e nel I'm masochismo il... chi è il maggiore is... mio angelo custode del masochismo who is, David who is, who is the, the, allora the guardian angel of masochistic il cannibal Jack... causa non c'è David, David S. S. See, he's a masochist who picks on people uh... basically allora ho detto on, yeah. forse facendo un seguito di e della okay, la casa maybe, che spettura del parco potrei the, mettere lo spirito di David S. I can put the spirits of David S. That's the reason. Other questions? Okay, we got one more from the crowd here. Uh, make it a good one, it might be the last. Um, this is for anybody involved in Cannibal Holocaust. When you guys got that call that basically said, hey, this movie looked so real that uh, we need to make sure you didn't kill anybody. Was there any feeling of accomplishment? Like, yeah, we made that and it looks awesome. So, just wondering. Anyone, anyone on the crowd? Uh, Carl, Francesca, when you, when you were done with it, were you, were you happy? It can you translate so that question into Italian for me? I'm sorry. No, but I, but I can translate it into, 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 into drunk guy. He was asking, when the film was done, were you proud you made something that looks so lifelike it actually upset people? No, because Ruggero, he make us to sign a contract that we have to disappear. And so in the end of the day, when you make this movie, then you feel that you have just to hide yourself and go far away from that. So nobody say, oh, you have been so good. Look, you look like real. No, just, just disappear. You're too real. Go away. Now, we do know the film had some legal problems because of that in Italy. Would any, yes, yes, uh, yes, yes. Uh, uh, Ruggero or anyone like to uh, actually comment on that? aspect yeah, of but, it. Yeah, but this is, you know, legal, it, we, we, it was not true, so well, legal, he got the legal problem, but you know, this is uh, easy, easy to sort, no? If someone say you kill Francesca Ciardi, but I'm here. Yeah, but so. you're here, yeah, exactly, exactly. So we, this is uh, not a big, a big ahead, deal, John. no? So I'd like to answer that. When, when you're making a movie, uh, you're living moment to moment, day by day, in these little bubbles, and the bubble moves around, and you're not quite sure what, what the movie is. And um, in, in fact, the only person who knows what the movie is is the director. And they're not always sure because they got to wait till they see what they got till they get back to the editing room to see what they got. And then it might be that and it might not be that. Um, my experience was that um, I actually didn't see the movie for 20 years and didn't hear anything about it for uh, probably, well, i heard about it right off the bat, and then uh, I heard that it was banned in eight countries, and I thought, oh, good. <laughs> and I went on with my acting career, and 20 years later, I finally saw it. So was I proud that, uh, uh, let me put it this way, when, um, when Grindhouse Releasing found me and did the uh, interview with me and put out the, um, 
the DVD in 2004, I think, the 25th anniversary DVD, and they said, you've got so many fans out there, you're not going to believe it. And I, can't, I have to tell you, I, I still don't believe it. Thank you. Well, so many people, they struggle a lifetime with that and to find one film. We have one more question here. We're going to make it a good one, buddy. You're the end. No pressure. Up Campbell Holocaust to Francesca and Carl. Um, so during filming the movie, did you have any other frustrating moments that you can share with us? And also, what is your overall opinion of the finished movie? Overall opinion of the finished movie? So you meaning, what, what do we, how do we consider like the movie? Like okay, honestly, I want to say something. If I get back in my, in my life, okay, because me, what I say, I just removed this movie from my CV. <laughs> I just took it off. I said, go away, this movie from my CV. So I did, I, I hide. It's like, whatever you have done, everything. But then it was never a cannibal. If I went back, okay, Ruggero offered me to do the House of the Age of the Park or whatever it was. If I went back in my career, I would, you know, knew, knowing today, I would do exactly another cannibal holocaust, the House of the Age of the Park, yes. or whatever, whatever. But because this is, would be a career. Yes, yes. Thank you. you know, That's what we like to hear. People are proud of their work. In fact, I, mess, I messed up mine, you know, and I messed up because I wanted to work with Lee Woolman, I wanted to work with uh, Bolognini, I did nothing. The only thing I really did, well, the only thing, only, only something that I really did it was Cannibal Holocaust. <laughs> I wouldn't change a thing. Yes. Uh,